Welcome to episode fourteen eighty seven. George Bishop, fracking oil billionaire from Mississippi, is quite secretive. No interview, no video. Now here's a picture of George Bishop with his wife. This is an outline of episode fourteen eighty seven. Drilling for oil in shale rock deep below the surface, fueling America's biggest oil boom in decades, and igniting an economic revival in America's heartland. Plus, environmental concerns about fracking for oil and gas help wean us off our dependence on foreign oil. And it's helping create an American oil boom the likes of which hasn't been seen in decades. <laughs> It's just going to knock your socks off. It's going to be a game changer. It's really going to help our economy. He was born in 1937 in Raleigh, Mississippi, United States. In 1958, at the age of 21, he graduated from Mississippi State University with a degree in petroleum geology. In 1981, at the age of 44, he founded his own company. Geo Southern began rich as a pioneer of shell fracking in Eagle Fort Shell, Texas. In 2013, he sold Geo Southern to Devon Energy for six billion dollars in cash. He became a billionaire, and he made his second fortune when he was 83. The year was 2021. He sold Hainesville Shell natural gas for 1.85 billion dollars to Southwestern Energy. In May 2022, George Bishop is 84 years old, has a net worth of 2.7 billion dollars. Part two: The Five Lessons of George Bishop. Lesson one: He helps the United States to become energy independent. Through new technology of fracking and shale gas, he is one of many shale oil billionaires. Lesson two: Start old. He was 44 years old when he started his company, Geo Southern. Lesson three: Secretive. I cannot find any interview, any videos on him, and only about five pictures. I also cannot find out what he did between 1958, when he graduated with a degree in geology, and 1981, when he founded his company, Geo Southern. And for constant transformation, he actually made most of his fortune in his 70s and in his 80s. And five small charity. He built a very small park, and he gave some scholarship in geology. Overall, he's quite a stingy billionaire. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.